In life, we're all bound to face setbacks, challenges, and moments that test us. But what if I told you that building resilience and perseverance isn't just about getting through tough times, it's about growing through them. Join me in today's video as I share the wisdom I've gathered over the years about what it really takes to bounce back and keep moving forward. If you're ready to take on life's challenges with strength and purpose, this one is for you. Don't forget to subscribe for more insights on personal growth. And if this message resonates with you, give it a thumbs up and share it with someone who might need it. There's a saying, smooth seas never made a skilled sailor. And when you think about it, it's absolutely true. Our resilience, our perseverance, these aren't traits we're born with. They're muscles we build, little by little, through every challenge, every setback, and every single time we think about giving up but choose to keep going. Now, resilience isn't just about bouncing back from hardships. Real resilience is about growing from them. It's about letting those challenges shape us, build us, even transform us. Because when we're willing to step into the uncomfortable, we come out on the other side stronger and wiser. Today, I want to share a few lessons I've picked up about building resilience, staying grounded, and finding strength when life throws its hardest punches. I remember a time in my life when things weren't going the way I planned. It felt like the world was slipping through my fingers, no matter how hard I tried to hold it together. I wanted to just give up. But deep down, I knew that if I let that moment defeat me, I'd carry the regret with me forever. So I made a choice to push through, to look my fears and failures straight in the eye and keep moving. And let me tell you, that was one of the most transformative decisions I ever made. You see, resilience starts with a choice, and that choice often starts in the mind. What we tell ourselves when we're facing struggles matters. Instead of saying, why me? Try asking, what can I learn from this? With that simple shift, every setback becomes a stepping stone and every failure becomes a lesson. And this brings me to another key point, acceptance. Accept that life is going to challenge you. Accept that not everything will go according to plan and that's okay. When we accept life's uncertainties, we start to see every difficulty as part of the journey, part of the bigger picture. But here's the thing, resilience isn't just about facing the big storms. Sometimes it's the little things, the tiny moments of daily perseverance that truly shape us. Whether it's keeping a promise to yourself to work out, to finish that book, or to get up after a sleepless night to face the day, these small acts of perseverance build strength. They create a foundation for us to rely on when things really get tough. So how do you start? How do you build this resilience, this perseverance that everyone talks about? Here's something I've learned. Start small, set a small goal, something you know you can achieve and then achieve it. It doesn't have to be anything huge. Maybe it's waking up a bit earlier each day or dedicating 10 minutes to something you're passionate about. But stick with it. Even when you don't feel like it, even when there's no immediate reward, keep at it. Because resilience isn't about the reward. It's about the habit of showing up over and over. And here's another thing I found helpful. Don't go it alone. Building resilience doesn't mean facing everything on your own. Surround yourself with people who lift you up, who remind you of your strength when you've forgotten it. Lean on friends, family, mentors, people who've been through their own battles and understand that journey. Resilience doesn't mean being invincible. It means being human and recognizing that sometimes strength comes from having others by your side. Now, I wanna leave you with this. Resilience and perseverance aren't about avoiding pain or avoiding failure. They're about choosing to continue in the face of it, to find meaning in the journey, and to let every experience, good or bad, teach you something valuable. Thanks for spending these few minutes with me today. If this message resonated with you, if you're ready to keep building your resilience, hit that like button and share this video with someone who might need to hear it. And hey, let's grow together. Subscribe if you haven't already for more talks like this one. Until next time, remember, resilience is a choice and it starts today. So, next time life throws a challenge your way, ask yourself, what can I take from this? How can I grow through this? Remember, every challenge, every setback is just another step on the path to becoming a stronger, wiser, and more resilient you.